Also breaking at this hour, a formerly respected judge now headed to prison. Casey Moreland was the subject of a News 4 I-Team investigation that lasted more than a year. And today, the former General Sessions judge stood before a federal judge to hear his sentence. News 4 I-Team's Nancy Amons broke the story nearly two years ago now. Tonight, she tells us how it all ends for Moreland. Nancy? Well, Tracy, the sentence, 44 months in federal prison, just shy of four years. Federal prosecutors say Moreland had abused his position of power for years, stealing money from his drug court clients, giving special treatment to his friends and lovers, destroying evidence, tampering with witnesses. The U.S. Attorney's Office had asked Judge Waverly Crenshaw to give Moreland five years. He obviously got less. Moreland's wife was one of the witnesses who testified on his behalf today. A Judge C Crenshaw, though, imposing the sentence, called Moreland disgrace and said um, he called Moreland uh, he said you have a reckless self-centered mentality that you are above the law this is an egregious case it's a case of someone who raised their right hand swore an oath put on a judicial robe and then decided to violate that oath and that trust that the people put in him and I think it's appropriate that he's gonna trade that judicial robe in for a, a prison jumpsuit now, Moreland talked to the judge today, addressed the court, apologized for his actions. Judge Crenshaw, I think, summed up what a lot of people were thinking. Uh, this is a, the end of a very sad story. Tom and Tracy? Thank you very much. And if it weren't for Nancy Amons, everyone, no one would ever know about Casey Moreland's crimes. Her reporting led to that federal investigation. You can find all of Nancy's work on this case right now on WSMV.com and the News 4 app.